All set. Good evening. I would like to call tonight's joint town council slash school committee meeting to order. Today is Monday, September 26. It is 6:31. Agenda item number one: meeting call to order by myself. Agenda item number two: I'm going to before roll call. I'm going to request that we do the pledge of allegiance. So can we do the pledge of allegiance? Mr. Bishop? Present. Ms. Duball? Present. Mr. Lazo? Present. Dr. Page? Present. Ms. Peliquin? Present. Mr. Wang? Present. Councillor Eau Claire? Present. Councillor Carrasco? Present. Councillor Clements? Present. Councillor DePietro? Councillor Estrada? Present. Councillor McKenzie? Present. Councillor Mana? Present. Councillor Steves? Present. Councillor Vecchia? Present. 14 present. Thank you. Um, before we continue, I just want to um, let the public know and let uh, all the members here on the dais know that unfortunately, due to illness um, uh, tonight, um, Dr. Huzenga will not be here. Um, she has given the authority to our director of finance, resource, and operations director, Mr. Daniel Didi, um, to conduct the business on her behalf. So therefore, I just want to just make that clear that that's why she is not here. Um, agenda item number three is review the following three candidates request to fill a school committee vacancy effective immediately through June 30th, 2017 due to a former member resignation. Um, a is Martina Shea, B is Spiro Thomo, and C is Carrie Walker. Um, this board has heard from Martina Shea and Spiro Thomo and at this time, I'm going to ask uh, Ms. Kerry Walker to come and address the, the members here at the dais and just to give us a brief introduction of who you are and uh, the reason uh, you desire to fill that vacancy. Thank you, Chairman. Um, and I apologize for all of you for not being at the last meeting. Uh, please do not take, think that I don't take this seriously because it means the world to me to be part of the children's education here in town. Um, my daughter is a senior here at Southbridge High, and for the past 15 years, I've been a very active volunteer. I have been in the classrooms. I've been on multiple field trips. I can't even tell you how many, uh, including two bus trips to Virginia Beach with a busload full of band students, which is always fun. I've even spent the night in an uh, emergency room in New Jersey with one of the students. Um, I've been backstage uh, working with those kids. I've been on the school council at three different schools, uh, part of the um, LSG, and also the search committees for the new principal and assistant principals. Um, I feel that it's extremely important for all parents to be involved um, with their child's education and for me, it's personal. Um, my daughter gives 110% and I can't do anything less than what she does because what kind of parent would I be if I did that? Um, I just feel like this town has gone through so many changes and now we're on the cusp of so many more, so many brighter and I would really love to be a part of that. I also feel that if you're not helping, you're hurting. So it's just within me to come here and whether I make it tonight or not onto the school committee, I will still volunteer for everything because she's involved in everything and we have about six parents in town that do the bulk of the work. <laughs> um, so if I don't see you after this, then I'm sure I'll see you at the concession stands at the plays, um, at the softball games, and wherever else I'm needed. And uh, like I said, I do thank you for this opportunity, um, especially given not being here at the last meeting. Thank you. At this time, we're going to ask, um, give the members on the dice uh, the opportunity to ask Ms. Kerry Walker questions. I have Councillor Mana. Thank you, Mr. Chair, for you too, Ms. Walker. Um, 
I asked the other two candidates this two weeks ago, so I want to give you the opportunity to answer. How do you feel about the state um, receivership? Honestly, I think it's overdue. I think we've been failing for a long time, um, and I really wish something had been done sooner. But now that they're here, I openly embrace it. Um, I think the only thing we can do, whether we agree with it or not, is open our arms and ask what can we do as a community. It's not just my job as a parent for my child, it's for every other child in this community. I have dozens of children at the schools that call me Mama Walker um, because that's what I do. And I think that the entire community needs to stand behind this, whether we agree or not, um, because it's the only opportunity to change and it's the only option we have. So, like I said before, if you're not helping, you're hurting. Thank you. You're welcome. Any other members that would like to ask Ms. Walker a question? School Committee Member Peliquin. Hi. Uh, I asked this question to the uh, candidates at our last meeting, so I would like to ask it as to you as well. Um, do you have any opinions uh, as far as the uh, state aid funding we are getting from the state currently? Like, do you think the state is doing enough to help us financially with paying for what the school district needs? Honestly, we need so much. And I know that a lot has already been put in to implement so many of the changes. But my concern is what will happen later. Are we going to continue to have that funding? And how much, and no, I don't think we have enough, to be quite honest with you. I don't think, um, I don't think we have enough at all. I think that our teachers are underpaid. I think we're, um, I think we're lacking in a lot of areas. That's my honest belief. And I, I've worked closely with so many teachers over the years, and I've seen the struggles, I've seen the triumphs. So could they do more if they had more? Absolutely. That's, that's my take on it. I think there can always be more. Well, we, we just need more. Thank you. You're welcome. Thank you. Anybody else want to address Ms. Walker? Thank you, Ms. Walker, for your time. Thank you for this Thank opportunity. Thank you all very much. At this time, moving on to agenda item number four, I'm going to entertain a motion to vote for selected candidate to the school committee effective immediately through June 30th, 2017. At this time, we have three candidates, so therefore, um, we will do a roll call and um, just state the last name of the individual that you will be uh, voting for. Roll call, please. Mr. Bishop. Mr. Thomas. Ms. Duval. Shay. Mr. Lazo. Mr. Thomo. Dr. Page. Thomo. Ms. Peliquin. Shay. Mr. Wang. Shay. Councillor Eau Claire. Shay. Councillor Carrasco. Walker. Councillor Clements. Tomo. Councillor DiPietro. Spiro. Councillor Estrada. Walker. Councillor McKenzie. Walker. Councillor Manna. Tomo. Councillor Steves. Shay. Councillor Vecchia. Thomo. Seven for Tomo, five for Shea, three for Walker. Thank you. Congratulations to Mr. Thermo. You are now the uh, remaining member of the school committee. Um, but before I continue, uh, Mr. Daniel Didi, do you agree with the votes that have been taken? Through the chair, yes. Thank you. I need a motion to adjourn. So moved. Second. All those in favor? Meeting adjourned. Thank you.